Coming up next, it's a UFC women's bantamweight division matchup. Well, this young woman has a great skill set, but certainly it's the striking defense that comes out when you watch the film. She'll use movement and defense to set up her own offensive angles, but she'll hang out in the pocket because she's so confident in her ability to stick and move and get her head off of that center line. Really as good a defender of strikes as we have in this women's division. This girl has some of the best takedown defense I've ever seen inside the octagon. She's so good at stuffing takedowns and punishing her opponents that she actually discourages takedown attempts. One of the best in the business at stuffing takedowns. Well, it sounds trite, but they say sometimes the best offense can be a good defense, and the cliche certainly applies here. She can stick and move with the best of them, and she's not afraid to hang in the pocket because she can do so without taking significant damage. She has frustrated some truly high-level opponents with her ability to stick and move and get her head off the center line. This girl has a ridiculous chin, and a chin like hers is such an amazing asset to have. She can take shots, she has massive confidence in her ability to take shots, and she stays in the pocket and lands big bombs with her counter strikes. All right, just about ready for live action. Here is tonight's tale of the tape. So a more than five-year gap between these two fighters when it comes to the age, with big differences in height and reach. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the Honda Center in Anaheim, California. This woman is a mixed martial artist making her professional debut here tonight. She stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 135 pounds. Body out of Las Vegas, Nevada, the Nightmare! And now introducing her opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This woman is a Muay Thai kickboxer and jiu-jitsu fighter. Making a professional debut here tonight. She stands five feet two inches tall, weighing in at 126 pounds. Body out of North Hollywood, California, the professional. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. We will have a clean fight. Touch gloves this morning. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time. And it is going to go Ready, down right Ready. now. Good. Scheduled for five five-minute rounds here tonight. Lands a big right hand over. The left hook hits home. Lands a big right hand early. She blocked the punch. Very nice sweep. She winds up in the guard. Trying to take the back here. Oh, she found the target there. That'll work. Excellent movement and transitions here on the ground. Staying busy. 
Fighters back to their feet here. And she hits the hips. Nice judo throw. Good shot. Trying to stay heavy here as best she can. Oh, there's a good shot from the bottom. She establishes full mount. Nice shot to the head. That landed. The ground strikes continue to pile up. Big shot from the bottom. She's showing good defense here. She's got that arm trapped. Just over three minutes to go round one. Good hammer fist. Wow. And very effective with the ground and pound. Big punch. Oh, one elbow after the next. That's hard to watch. Excellent posture here. A little bit uneventful. She's now back in full mount. Oh, elbow to the head. Good punch. Back to the mount again. Splits the guard and connects with the punch. Postures up. Oh, nice elbow there from the top position. I'm surprised that one didn't open her up. The ground strike's starting to pile up. There's a nice left hand. She's in a position right now to try to attack with a submission. It looks like she's got that arm pretty tight. That's interesting. That's high level stuff. Big right hand. Reversal here and in the full guard. Trying to spin to the back. Nice. Well, just because you're on your back doesn't mean you can't throw offense. Staying busy here. You like to see that, Joe. Landing some big punches from this position. Big elbow. Lands a punch. Continuing to stay busy here on the ground. Good elbow. Strong ground and pound here, Joe. Oh, Sage work from the bottom here as she tags her with the punch. Postures up here. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Back to full mount again. Splits the guard and connects there. The ground strikes continue to pile up. Throws the right hand there. Ten seconds. She's got that ground and pound going now, Joe. It's the elbow there. Four uh, shots for the uh, underground one. Let's take a look at it again here. Let's look at it from a different angle. Let's take a look at it from a different angle. Brittany Palmer doing her thing as usual. Defensively to avoid the double leg takedown there. Get 
the hands going here early. Oh! This could be it right here. Oh, very nice. Man. Nice takedown. But look at this. Right back to the top. Right back to the side control. This is a dominant grappling display. Beautiful body, body shot. shot there, too. She's now transitioned to full guard. She gets her back. Oh, look at that! Look at that transition. Big punch from the top. She's in full mount again. Big shot. Gets the elbow up into the target. Well done, sweep, and winds up in guard. Beautifully timed sweep and right into side control. Joe doing a nice job here, staying busy from the bottom. Trying to take the back here. Excellent sweep. Oh, the right hand is there for her. She moves to back control. Under three minutes here to go in round two. She moves into full mount. She executes a very nice sweep and winds up in guard. Neither fighter is really doing anything. Into side control again. Trying to spin to the back. Oh, that punch will count. Landed flush. Good punch. She's moved into side control. It appears the cut on her face is getting worse. Big Ooh. elbow. Oh, big shot from the top. She's out. She's that out cold. Out. She's out cold. Big ground and pound KO. Yeah, Joe, she might have the best ground and pound game in this entire division. It was certainly on full display here tonight. And it's one thing when you're trying to score on the ground and bide some time a little bit. She was trying to finish this result, literally trying to knock her opponent's head through the canvas. And ultimately, she gets the desired result here tonight. And maybe a $50,000 performance bonus will follow. Let's take a look at that again. Great angle here. Lands perfectly, and that's the end. And there she is after the massive knockout. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. We now go inside the octagon where Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 57 seconds of round number two. He's playing the winner by knockout. The nightmare. Well, there are a few greater highs in all of professional sports than to have your hand raised inside that octagon. But she took it a step further tonight. Massive knockout victory. No TKO here. This was a flush KO. She's probably getting some bonus money. One thing I can guarantee you, she is getting a massive high-profile opportunity next.